Borrowing from the way cockroaches move along walls, scientists have created a robotic catheter that safely guides itself through a beating pig's heart. According to a study in the journal Science Robotics, it's one of the first times researchers have shown that a truly autonomous surgical robot could navigate inside the heart. You can use a robot to often do the procedure just as fast as the human can do it. Um, but if you're just as fast and you're not really any better, what's the value of the robot? And so we step back and say, well, how about if we have the robot do it by itself? Um, and we don't want to leave the clinician completely out of the picture. So we'll have the robot perform the navigation task, getting from the base of the heart to the spot on the valve where the leak is. And then we'll have the robot tell the clinician, look, we're at, we think we found the leak. Now you go and deploy the device um, to close that leak. Researchers at Boston Children's Hospital use the robotic catheter to glide through the heart, tapping periodically against the heart's valve, similar to the way a cockroach or rat navigates using their whiskers. The robotic catheter tested was slower than a doctor using a joystick, but the idea is to eventually leave the routine parts of surgery to a robot. The researchers envision a day when the technology will free a surgeon to focus on more complex tasks. I use the analogy of a, a, a fighter pilot and a fighter plane. Um, the, the mission of a fighter pilot is not flying the plane. The mission is to deliver a payload or do reconnaissance. And it's those higher level things that the pilot is focused on. And the plane is flying itself, um, taking care of defending itself and the pilot. And in the same way, autonomy and robotics um, can take care of those lower level um, tasks. The technology is still years away from being used on humans. But researchers say the robotic catheter could reduce the time patients and medical staff are exposed to x-rays that currently are used for catheter navigation. Joseph Frederick, Associated Press.